Hey guys, welcome back for today's video where I'm going to be walking you through the process of how to set up an Amusen Smart Life Wi-Fi plug. If you're interested in purchasing this device, I'll have a link down in the video description. It is one of the more affordable smart plugs that you can get at Amazon.com. So right out of the box, go ahead and plug it in to your desired outlet. Then we need to go over and set up the Smart Life application. If you're on Android, you need to open up the Google Play Store. If you're on an iPhone, you need to open the App Store. And I'm on Android, so I'm going to go ahead and launch the Play Store. And then in the search bar, you need to type in Smart Life. Once we type in Smart Life, the top result should show up there, the little blue icon with the white house outline. We're going to click on that, and then we're going to go ahead and select Install. And then once we're done installing, we can click Open right here on the download page, or it'll also create an icon on one of our main pages if you can't, for whatever reason, find the Smart Life icon on one of the main pages of your smartphone device, you can click the apps in the bottom section of your phone. For me, it's in the bottom right-hand corner. And I'm going to go ahead and select that and find the Smart Life icon. Once you find it, for me, it's right down there in the bottom right-hand corner. Go ahead and drag and drop it onto whatever page that you want to have it on. So we're going to launch it here. The first thing you need to do is register an account. It's pretty simple. Just go ahead and click register and you have to agree to the privacy policy and then type in the email that you want to use to register. Once you're done typing in your email, it'll send you a verification code and your code's obviously going to be different than mine, but it's just a six digit code. Then you need to enter a password for this account. Then go ahead and click create family. And the family name that I'm going to set for this example is just going to be smart plug and then click done in the upper right hand corner and then click completed, and then click the little plus in the upper right-hand corner and find where it says electrical outlet. We're gonna click on that. And now we need to make sure that our smart plug is discoverable. Now to do this, we have to go over to our smart plug and hold the power button down for around five seconds until the little light in the bottom right-hand corner of your smart plug is blinking quickly about two times per second. And once it's blinking quickly, then it should be in a situation where we can discover it and set it up to our internet connection. So we're going to go ahead and select our network. For me, it's going to be Frontier 22. And then you need to type in your Wi-Fi password so that it can set up that internet connection. So it's going to go through this connecting process here. I'm going to skip ahead a little bit so we don't need to watch this whole loading screen. All right, so then it's done with that and we need to select what room that this device is gonna be in. For me, it's gonna be in my living room, which is the first option and then click completed. And then you're gonna be prompted to upgrade the software if you need to do that. So it's gonna go through the upgrade process. But then at this point, we're pretty much all set up within the Smart Life application with our smart plug. Now we need to go over to the Google Home application to set it up over there and link it so that we can control it with our voice through our Google Home device. So we're gonna go ahead and launch the Google Home application. And on this screen, we're gonna go ahead and click the add button, the little plus icon there. And then we're gonna go ahead and click set up device. And at the bottom, it says works with Google. We're gonna click that option, have something already set up. Now on this page, we need to click the magnifying glass in the upper right hand corner and type in smart life. And it'll pop us up for us eventually right there, the little blue icon with the white house outline. We're going to click that and then we need to make sure that we're logged into our correct Google account as well as after that, hooking it up to our smart life account. And then we're going to authorize that connection between these two accounts. And now it's going to be linking our smart life to our Google home. And there it shows up and we're going to go ahead and select it and add to a room and I'm going to add it to my living room and then click next. And now it should be all set up and ready to go. The device was moved over to my living room setting. So now at this point, I'm going to go through and test out to see how it works. So we're going to go over and we're going to plug in a desk lamp here for the purposes of this exercise. And we're going to go ahead and first manually turn the light on. And then we need to command prompt it by saying, Hey Google, turn off smart plug. And then to turn it back on, we say, Hey Google, turn on smart plug. 
and you can see that's how you turn it on and off with your voice command. So that's going to wrap up this video, guys. I hope it was helpful walking you through this step-by-step -step process. There's a number of steps that you have to go through, but once it's all set up, it's really a convenient thing to be able to control something like a lamp with your voice. So thanks for stopping on in. Consider subscribing for more, and I hope to see you guys back here for future videos.